A lot of people are asking, now your summer over. We've seen all the rain. This video from Everett, uh, also from Puyallup and Kent, so much rain coming down. First in North As Everett, viewer see. Kyan Cooper says she's right never there. seen flooding like this. So she describes it as a waterfall coming from a roof of an mm -hmm. apartment building, then cascading down the stairs you see right there. Then along Marine View Drive in Everett, Dylan Logan capturing these images, Dylan telling police uh, have blocked, tells police have blocked off the road between 10th and 13th Street because there's so much water on the road. And in Pierce County, this was a scene in Puyallup earlier today. We want to thank Balabod for sending us this video clip. And here's one way to take advantage of all the rain. Kent police officers were at the Civic Raceways doing some training exercises, practicing driving fast on the wet roads. Okay, uh, likely some wet roads out there for sure tonight in some places, right, Jordan? Let's not forget Saturday afternoon, Saturday evening, mm. right? The thunderstorms blossoming all across Puget Sound. Today was active, yes. Check out the funnel cloud. This was tweeted out. Social media goes crazy when every time there's a weather event. And of course, we rely on you to let us know what's going on in your neck of the woods. This is near the Conway area. Uh, looks like we had what looks appears to be a funnel cloud uh, near the Conway area. Doesn't look like it reached tornado status. Status, but when we take a look at the radar and you rewind it to the current time frame, here's the cell near Stanwood that's moving from south to north before it hits Mount Vernon and brings some rainfall. So if we look at the current radar now, a lot of that activity has quieted down. We still have a few showers out there, which means we're still going to see a few lingering rainfall uh, rain showers early tomorrow morning. And uh, most of the showers near Highway 12 are calling it quits, but we do have some rain up towards Port Townsend where you guys have already picked up about an inch of rainfall and that's working its way into uh, Whidbey Island and that could work its way closer to the San Juan. So we're going to look at this entire system, right? The, the timeline of what can completely be out of here when we see a, a shift in the weather pattern. I'll be back in a few with that.